Hi guys, it is Ben again. I'm going to be talking to you today about sales processes. So a sales process is found, um, if we come over here into our opportunities and click on one of these, uh, the sales process is shown right here. Uh, this is called a path component, which is the, the path is the actual visual representation of the sales process. Um, you can see it's got all these stages here, prospecting, qualification, needs analysis, value proposition, um, and if you look over here in our details, each of these stages has a different probability that it will uh, be closed or it will, uh, you'll win the deal, win the opportunity. So for example, if we move over here to value proposition and mark that as the current stage, you can see that we're about a 50% probability of winning that opportunity. Um, so what if we want to make our own sales process? Let's go through that. So I'm going to go over here to setup, and let's look at that sales process that exists right now sales process okay i'm gonna click on this one it's small and you can see that um, over here it has all of the process values as we saw um, right here okay so you can you can click on any of these remove it um, add it back in it gets added in a certain spot and save it but let's uh let's make our own here so i'm gonna click new um, existing sales process, I'm going to keep it at master right now and I'll explain that later. Sales process name, I'm going to click or type in large, save. Okay, uh, right now all of these are added in, um, but let's say I actually, just for the sake of this example, I don't want, uh, let's say, all of these ones. And I also want to add a new one in here. I don't see any option to add a new stage value. So what we're actually going to do here, I'm going to open the object manager in a new tab. We're going to come over to the opportunity object. Let's just type in opportunity. And in our fields and relationships, I'm going to come down to stage. Stage is a standard field on opportunity. Um, and that is where the sales process values come from, from the stages. So you can see these are all the options for the sales process stages. Uh, as we can see over here, these are all contained right here. Uh, well, let's say we wanted to add a new one. So I'm going to click new and I'm just going to name it test. Okay, uh, type is open so it's not uh, a closed stage value. Test and the probability I'm going to give it is 45. 45%. Um, I'm going to leave this at pipeline and then I'm not going to click this automatically quite yet. You could do that to save some time, but just to uh, show you this, I'm going to click save. And you can see right now it's it's set here at test um, and you'll want to reorder it as well so it, it is ordered in by probability. So I'm going to click reorder and then oh, let's see which one was it after needs analysis, okay. Put it up here, it's after needs analysis, save, and there you go. Okay, so now we have that new stage in there, and this should, I think, if I just refresh it, I think we should, ah, there you go, available values test. So let's pull that one in, and it should get put right in there, it needs analysis, let's take, uh, let's take some of these out and take out this one too just for kicks. Okay, I'm gonna save that one. Okay, so now we have this large one right here. We have a large sales process and a small sales process. And now in order to see that, we're gonna have to assign it to a record type. Um, you can have different sales processes for different record types. We're gonna talk about record types in a different video. As you can see here, we have two record types already created. Um, and so I'm gonna click over here into large. And right now, as you can see, the sales process is set to small. So all opportunities um, will have the small sales process, but I'm just gonna change it here to large. I'm gonna click save. Um, so that is saved now. So let's come back over here. And in our opportunities, I'm going to create a new opportunity. And I'm gonna select the record type of large. And I'm going to fill out these fields, test, close date, and oh, 
and stage. Uh -huh. You can see that it has changed the stages according to the uh, sales process that we're using. Select hours for test, 45%. Save that. And there you go. Um, this has the record type page layout for the large opportunity. It's got the sales process. And there you go. That's a customized sales processes to fit your situation.